guys who want to be gangsters, clubbing, pubbing, popping pills, open the books of history and you will come to an understanding that you ain't no gangster. You just a fake wannabe Scarface. In the sight of men, the wannabe gangsters, these guys hold some weight. But in the sight of the king of all kings, the master of the day of judgment, the one, the only, Allah the Almighty, these guys are more lighter than a mosquito's wing. And this is why I say, those guys who want to be gangsters, clubbing, pubbing, popping pills, no fast, no prayer, no nothing. You jack people, you rob people. Fear Allah, fear Allah, fear Allah. And if you don't fear Allah, then wait for the punishment of Allah to descend. You oppress women, you beat women, you go around slandering women, and all of a sudden, man thinks he's a bad man. You listen to the devil's music, you listen to Mavado, Vibes Cartel, you cruise around with your boys, with your girlfriends, up and down the road, Manchester. London, blasting the devil's music, smoking weed, and all of a sudden man thinks it's 50 cent. You wake up in the morning, plaster your face with MAC makeup, you carry a rusty Chanel bag, straightens out her hair with a GHD, then she puts on the fake lashes, the long nails, the hoops around the ear and then she puts on her high heels she puts on a hijab with 10 inside it the camel hump and then she puts a abaya on and then she puts on the chanel perfume and then she walks the walk and she talks the talk she likes what she sees why because all eyes are me and then she gets picked up dropped off to one of these shisha lounges. Off comes the abaya, off comes the hijab. She gets her phone out and she puts it to the ear. You know and I know no one's on the other side. She puts a pipe in her mouth, thinking she's some Jamaican yardie. And all of a sudden, girl thinks she's Beyonce. Fear Allah, fear Allah, fear Allah. You slander the shiuch and all of a sudden man thinks he's Imam Al-Bukhari. But your return is to Allah the Almighty. I ask, is there a problem with Abu Bakr radiallahu an? Is there a problem with Umar radiallahu an? With Uthman radiallahu an? With Ali radiallahu an, with Fatima radiallahu anha, with Aisha radiallahu anha, the answer is no. Then why are man's following Dr. Drake? Then why are man's following Drake? Then why are girls following Beyonce? From amongst the companions, there was a companion. The Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said, the one who has favored me the most with his wealth, with his company is Abu Bakr radiallahu an. And if I was to take a friend other than my Lord, I would have taken Abu Bakr as such. Ali radiallahu an said, the best of people after the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam is Abu Bakr radiallahu an. And there was another companion. 
the Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam said that if there was a prophet after me, it would have been Umar radiallahu an. The Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam said, "O oh son of Khattab, I swear by the one whose hands my life is in, you do not walk down a path." Except that the shaitan sees you and he turns directions other than yours. Ali radiallahu an said, and the best of people after Abu Bakr radiallahu an is Umar radiallahu an. I ask, who was their leader? Who was their commander? Who was their general? It was none other than the chosen one. The blessed one, the noble one, the forgiving one, the bearer of glad tidings, the seal of all prophets, the imam of all the prophets, the leader of the companions, the messenger Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam.